Zeratul, old friend. I have the keystone you believed would lead to our salvation. And yet, faith alone will not defeat Amon. As Hierarch, I was made aware of a location where our Kalai scientists experimented on new weaponry in secret. Within the Glacius facility, the Purifier program has been reborn. We must recover this immensely powerful technology. Welcome back to StarCraft 2, Lectheos of Void, and welcome to Galatius. Glacius facility. Within lies the greatest weaponry the Empire ever developed. It is the site of the Purifier Revival Program. Purifiers? The forbidden weapon? They were sealed away by the Conclave, never to be restored. The ancient purifiers are not kept here, Preserver. They are still locked away. Here, on Glacius, our researchers have been developing prototype weaponry inspired by that ancient technology. You speak above your caste, Kalai. This is unimaginable heresy. We are outmatched by Amon's forces and facing annihilation. If this technology may help us, we will use it. Unleashed his servants. Ready our warriors. Let's see whether any of you guys have something to say about that. Or oh, yeah, they do. Do. do you though? The Taldarim. They have not been seen since the Aeon of Strife. Before the Protoss were united by the Kala's Light. I'm afraid they returned some time ago, Rohana. We thought them fanatical servants of the Zelnaga for years. But in truth, they had enslaved themselves to Amon. Why would any being willingly follow Amon? That is unclear. The Taldarim call themselves the Chosen. What Amon has chosen them for, we do not know. They are dangerous foes who have helped forge the hybrid and shed blood in the name of our great enemy. Protoss turned upon Protoss. The Deul demands retribution for such offense. They must be destroyed. If it is their fate, it shall be. The purifier weaponry that has been researched here could prove to be a valuable addition to our arsenal. That is what I am hoping. Is there any merit to Rohana's fears? The Kalai on Glacius have prototyped the technology with successful results. It is said that these experimentations are no different than the Templar they are replications of, a byproduct of quantum predictive analytics. They were and are still only machines. Do not give them such credence, Karax. We too are machines of a biological nature. I often marvel at the architecture, the design, the careful construction of our form, our machinery. The Zelnaga forged us as we forged the original purifiers. Ooh, I'm getting philosophical here. I think that is our almost it. Our reporting Amon's forces are conquering system after system. We must choose our plan of attack carefully, Hierarch. Sure. The rulings of the Conclave mean nothing to the Nerezim. We must discard the past divisions to pursue the future. Good, good. If we are to obtain the Purifier technology, then we must move quickly. The Taldarim are preparing to fire upon the facility. Well, let's do it. Hierarch, the Taldarim are unleashing their mothership's phase displacement beam against Glacius's orbital defenses. I am First Ascendant Alarak, and I've been charged with destroying this facility. You seek the technology vault, but you are too late. 
It will be annihilated along with the rest of this pathetic world. Use your time to withdraw from the system, or remain here and watch your forces burn to ash. I care little which you choose. He is not entirely correct. If we begin now, our forces could outpace the displacement beam. Then we are going in. Well, looks like we're going in. Let's let's build one of you here. You have not enough minerals. That's okay. What we should probably do is. Displacement beam is advancing. We must reach the vault before it is destroyed. Sure thing. Let's get one of these setups since now they're automated, so we may as well. We may as well get them set up now because there's no other investment, which is nice. Nice, 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 nice. So yeah, so the, the, the death laser is going to laser its way through the level. And we have to avoid the death laser like we avoided the Zerg initially in their very first mission. And make our way to the vault before the vault gets lasered. I'm detecting a Taldarine force amassing outside of our nexus point. We must prepare for assault. Wait, these sentries were left behind. Let me activate them. They are quite effective at restoring shields to nearby warriors. If you say so. Kill this guy here first and then get rid of those guys. Thank you. And there you no casualties. Lost some health though. And there. Our gateways are now calibrated to warp them in as well. Could have done that like a minute earlier or so, or like a couple missions earlier. Well anyway, let's get one of you here going. Forge, because we're probably gonna need that sooner or later. Let's get maybe some defenses going here as well, like generally speaking. Some defenses. And we're going to need those pylons sooner or later anyway, aren't we? There we go. Nice, 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 nice. We also want... Uh, what do we want? Oh, oh, you don't have the forge yet, yeah. Uh, you actually don't have any uh, special tech requirements, interestingly. But we want to max out our workers here first. We can we can use the, the the death laser already, but yeah, we need how much? Oh, you? Huh, I guess I, I guess I may as well use you now, because why not? Death laser is nice, but get gets getting a bunch of force here initially. That's quite nice. There we go. This will give us all the workers we need. And we should probably actually do something with you that might be helpful. Let's just queue this up, otherwise I'm going to forget about it. Let's get one more of you here as a generic worker. There we go. And then our economy is almost maxed out. Well, until we find an expansion which may or may not exist this level here specifically. You have to hurry up here a little bit soon, but let's see about that. We also want an army, otherwise we're just going to sacrifice more troops for nothing. And we definitely want... Do you want Dark Templar? Maybe, but we definitely want Robotics Facility. Maybe two. So, there we go. Almost there. Yes, the Passability Observer Simulator is noted here. Which is nice. Oh, we could actually build a Death Laser here. We could also build uh, a couple of you here. Maybe not so many that the... Go that we can't leave our own base, but yeah, maybe have one more. And then some some shield batteries here. Maybe just one more. We could also build a laser, but we'll have to see about that. Yeah, you use sucking that Vespian gas. It's delicious Vespian gas. This tab here looks really empty right now because there's almost nothing we have there. But anyway, we'll use a death laser here, but to be honest, I think the shield generators here are going to do a decent job here. There we go, indeed. We just come over here. So we can we can still leave our base, that's good to know. Maybe get 
another gateways. You never know when you need that many gateways. Let's have you here. Get yourself hotkeyed and you here get yourself hotkeyed as well. And maybe some annihilator. I forgot that I had these guys here now. But I do. So maybe move out and see that we get some stuff done here, hopefully. Annihilators are going to be useful because they're just that powerful. In the, in the campaign they're pretty good value for money. There we go, and I guess we're gonna destroy you here. Then let's see whatever secondary objective we get to, I don't know, collect more soul right in one form or another, because there is going to be one, obviously. Uh, do we just want to pop, pop a couple more of you here down? Why not? Because we may as well do that. Still easy-ish reinforcements. There we go, and we can afford more of you. So let's get more of you. Good, good, good. You come over here, so I think here it doesn't look like it. So let's get up this ramp here. See what awaits us there. Probably more actually, no. It appears the station scientists were storing raw solarite here as well. If possible, we should obtain it. Excellent. Solarite gathered. Okay. So let's just kind of hang out here. That's fine with me. Uh, okay, I guess I could probably attack you from above here. But also these guys... How can these guys... Oh yeah, they have vision thanks to the... Thanks to the... No, no, no. What, where are you going? Oh yeah, there's nothing it's to attack here. Do they have phoenixes? Yes, they are phoenixes. And there's the stasis beam here. There's a... A Taldarine force field. We need to destroy its power source to clear the way. Nice try here. Thank you. And goodbye. Let's see that we may build a couple more of you here. Do I? I guess I do. Let's do that then. Where's my worker? Here we go. Didn't think I would have all that many guys here already. But I'll, I'll take it. They sure do. Ah, we've discovered more sentries. I will activate them now. Oh no, there's an evil sentry. It's okay though. Okay. Because we may as well warp in more guys here because we can. Oh, hoo -hoo, one of you guys here. And dead. There we go. These patterns look super evil. Now that they now that they are red. We should let's see, I think we got all the upgrades here at this point. Okay, so we have the beam. We're not outpacing the beam yet. Our forces are near the displacement beam. We must remain alert and stay out of its range. Okay, if you say so. Uh, let's do that then. Oh, we, do we ever have enough minerals? I mean, do we ever truly have enough? Oh, that's an aircraft carrier. Oh, that's not fair. Well, I guess it's dead now. It doesn't really matter. There we go. Okay, let's make sure that we collect all of this here. Maybe this bonus here as well. And then we actually on a good track here. What do we have here? Oh, that's just some crystals. More pylons. Of course, we're going to get more pylons. And uh, we can afford one... Two, three, 
four, five. Oh man, you, you guys were standing close to the beam there. Okay, great. Wait a second, what do these guys have Templars? Well, never mind. You're not supposed not supposed to have those, but what can you do? Let's see what we have here. So the Teldarine, it looks like a Teldarine base, yeah, like a full base, not just. Get you involved here. May as well get those free reinforcements. You are easy to kill. Nice, 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 nice. I mean, uh, with the tanks here, everybody's easy to kill. Oh, did, did I just depower your building? Well, that sucks for you. There we go. So now they're referred as Teldarim Protoss, not just as Teldarim. Okay, let's so just destroy their base here. Shouldn't be too difficult, yeah. There we go. Oh, did I depower all of you? Well. That, that's a bit sad, isn't it? Well, what can you do? Get over here. We want even more of you. I guess we do. So let's see that we destroy all of you. Yeah, which probably isn't really necessary, but I guess they're going to leave us... At least to, alone to a certain degree. They probably have a second base. I mean, they always, they always have a second base, don't they? So let's see that we gather everyone here. And... No, there wasn't a gate here, there was one here. Okay, so we can probably open that from the other side. For now, let's cross here. Bunch of you here, please. Oh dear, power overwhelming. Uh, we can live with that. Oh, well. Now there's a whole lot less of you. You get involved here, please. Boom. That's the satisfying thing about the the Archons and Dark Archons, once they once their shields gone, they're essentially dead. Okay, what was that? I don't even know. Never mind. So the beam's here. Anything here doesn't look like it, but let's try to let's try to not get directly caught in the beam. Wow, you guys are just taking it here, aren't you? Are you even dodging that beam? Not so sure about that. Okay, you get out of the way here. Yeah, I know, I know. Okay, if you say so. Uh, let's... Everybody involved here then. And where's all that solarite? I guess we'll, we'll find out eventually. Oh, there's this guy's here. I did, didn't even see you there. Never mind. We should probably build more stuff. Yep, these buildings fall like toys. Oh, that, that shut down your stuff? Well, that, that sucks for you. Here we go. More sentries, I'll take it. Collect this here, and I guess the gate's now open. Looks like it, good, 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 good. Where are you? You get me a bunch more of these here. Hyrock, I'm detecting movement from the Taldarine fleet. Multiple transport signatures inbound on the facility. War prisms. Clever. Alarak is activating the facility's old defenses, using them against us. Okay. Well, we'll see about that. That wasn't so great, was it? Okay, let's try to get out of here. So maybe get... There we go. Okay, you kill this guy here immediately. Oh, 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 you you died quickly. I guess you're a heavy unit. And I've got heavy guys as well. Not too surprising. So some crystals here, but who cares? Where's that beam going exactly? Oh, you're... Are you going directly through me here? 
Where's that Solarite? Seriously, where's that Solarite? Kill all these Phoenixes here, please. Bunch more of you, bunch more of you, bunch more of you. No, no, not the beam. So, oh, maybe so there's Solarite here, because this is kind of a side path. Let's see about that. But seriously, where's that Solarite? Is there another path here we didn't take? There's one here. Another Solarite sample obtained. Probably down here, I would say. So, it's a bit unfortunate, but we'll have to see. Uh, I guess we... Yeah. Get over here, then. And we can even still overtake that beam, no worries. And let's let's just max out our pop just because, even though we're probably not going to need it. Do I not have enough minerals? Okay, here we go. Another one of you nuisances here. Okay, go through here. Oh, there we go. It's right here. Well, that was easy. Well, some some more guys here. Oh, okay, can't can't do that because we don't have vision. Uh, that's okay. Let's just try to overtake this this beam here, which shouldn't be too much of a problem. Maybe it's not that fast, is it? And I think we wiped out all the Teldarim. It seems like it. There we go. So Vanguard has arrived. Then let's see. Oh, you guys are still here. So how do you actually get? Down here. Oh wait, because this is just a ramp. Okay, N never mind that then. Oh wow, you had no health left. No, not the beam. Okay, let's just go through here. If you all burn, that's okay with me. But the sacrifice I'm willing to make. Whoa, 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 whoa! That beams are right in my face. Okay, let's destroy the pylons here. There we go. Doors open, and let's just get over here. Acquiring access. Work quickly, Face Smith. Focus the disruptor on their location. Let them burn. I have its coordinates. Warping aboard the container now. As you appear, Artemis. We shall meet again. The purifier weaponry is safely aboard the Spear of a Dune. Wait, there is a prototype war here, here as well. I will have to examine it more closely. Well, that wasn't actually all that bad. The time isn't super strict, and the Teller Remount that much of a threat. You could make the case that they're less of a threat than the, the hybrid. The worst thing they have are their own their own heavy walkers, but and well I guess they have one carrier and have like one or two purifiers. But that's not really that much of a threat. We even got all the achievements here. Yeah, I think we, we got close twice, but it didn't destroy anything. Oh yeah, I guess I guess think we destroyed almost everything they had. Yep, yeah, there we go. Pretty successful overall. I I would have expected another achievement to do this in under twenty minutes, but it doesn't really matter, does it? to see me, Faye Smith. Artanis, it is good to see you, young executor. Phoenix? How... how can this be? It was his cloned personality that was used for the purifier prototype. Given your friendship with the source personality, I thought... well... He believes he was brought from stasis and made a dragoon. Why are you here, Phoenix? I was given a directive by Ogdaris himself. 
to come to Glacius and serve the Templar. It is the last recollection from his memory web. The Great Templar were still encoded by order of the Conclave. Do you know about the experimentation done on Glacius? Why Aldaris gave you this order? I am a warrior, old friend. You know this as well as any. It is not my place to question the order of Adjudicator. This construction is highly advanced. An Adanium shell composed of atrilic compression mesh. It appears he was to be the first in a revival of the ancient program. Enough! I have fought far too long for the will of the Conclave to be examined like some specimen. I am Templar, and I am reunited with the dearest of friends. Is this not a glorious day? You are right, of course. Carax, these tests are no longer needed. Phoenix, welcome aboard the Spear of Adun. Yep, Undead Phoenix here. That's actually the second time that I count Phoenix dead. We have original Phoenix, then Dragoon Phoenix, and then like Zombie Dragoon Phoenix. It, 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 they just can't stop. He's always gonna come back because Blizzard just can't keep characters dead. You and I have stood shoulder to shoulder, blades thrumming in the heat of battle countless times, and now you lead the Protoss. I well with pride at the mere thought of it. I was chosen to represent the Hierarchy by the remaining Judicators and the clans of the Nerezim. I am still honored by their choice. Tassadar must be proud as well. Tassadar is gone, Phoenix. He fell, bravely sacrificing for his people. He saved us from annihilation. What? It... it cannot be. And... I... Fallen to the Zerg as well? It has. How long have I lingered in stasis, becoming this Dragoon? Do you know of the Purifier program, Phoenix? Of course. The greatest Templar minds replicated. Dangerous machines that had to be shut down. They were shut down. But we have never ceased the research, and still have tried to find ways to replicate our greatest Templar, to use that ancient technology. Why do you tell me this? I... I... We are facing a war like none we have seen before. We will need you in the days ahead. Maybe even the Purifiers. Then my blades are yours, old friend. Oop, he doesn't know who's gonna tell him. These new purifier designs rival any technology our people have previously conceived. The replication data is the sort that allows accurate duplication of one's consciousness. Phoenix's personality may be accurate. How accurate? Within the 99th percentile. So there is a chance for discrepancy. Quite a minuscule one. And in a lifetime, how many choices does that variation impact? Who would you be with such a difference in the decisions you've made? Keep a watchful eye on Phoenix. If he is to help us, I want to know who he is. Actually, I take it back. Aldanus is dead. I don't think he ever comes back. So what do we have here? Solar Lens. Can't activate that yet. Uh, but warp harmonization. The lens sounds pretty good. I guess we could. Of the strikes, pretty neat. I mean, mm -hmm. it's maybe. Okay, so 30 here. Could just go with deploy pylon. Then we just go with solar lens, just so we have the solar lens. And we could. I don't really want to give up auto similar. That's just so useful. Because we could just put more into construction time here and then into some additional pop here, so wh why not? Let's go to the War Council. The purifier technology cannot aid us, Hierarch. It is flawed to its core. Will you not heed the warnings of the past? It's the same about the abomination. 
We have Let's acquired see. new robotic support technology for review. So we have the sentry. Just shields to do friendly units simultaneously. Decrease damage to nearby friendly units. I guess that's just kind of neat, isn't it? We have the energizer. Movement speed of friendly units. Transforms to generate a power field. Power field that does what? That's kind of neat, isn't it? Oh, okay, so you can warp things in. Let's just try the, the energy up because why not? Uh, anything else? I guess we want to go to the bridge. Seeing Phoenix once more perplexes me. I feel sadness, but I should feel joy. It is said the warrior Phoenix was felled by the Queen of Glades. This approximation is not Phoenix, but he is a reminder of the loss you suffered. His voice. Thoughts, his very presence. He describes memories we shared with such vivid recollection. Every instinct I have tells me that this is my friend. But all logic defies it. We of the Nerezim often ponder whether our people are the sum total of their experiences, or are more than them. A truth lingering inside us. In time, we shall see if this phoenix has his own truth. Or is little more than a flawed forgery. Oh dear, H harsh words here. Anyway, I think that's it for today. Thanks for watching and take care.